No, I'm not going on a picnic, although that sounds really tempting. I'm inventorying my tablecloths and sheets and towels because the first frost hangs over us like the sword of Damocles. This time of year, I am more obsessed than ever with the weather forecast. I check it daily. No, I check it hourly because the first day of frost is the most depressing day for gardeners. But you can protect your flowers and veggies with cotton fabric or polypropylene row covers. And this will give you some protection to about 25 or 26 degrees. I, I can't even begin to think about it. And there are tropical plants to haul to safety as well. I'm dreading that too. But let's look at it from a different angle. Let's think of this as an opportunity to start our 2022 gardens. Yeah, that's much more cheerful. Be prepared. Have your snips and glass jars at the ready. You can take cuttings from so many plants and save yourself hundreds of dollars. Let me teach you how. Let's start with coleus, which are extremely vulnerable to frost. Even under cover, they can't even take a single degree of frost. I think I might be a coleus. Take cuttings six to eight inches long. Strip off the lower leaves and place the jars in a south or west facing windowsill. Roots will form at the leaf nodules underwater. And then at some point, you can put them in soil. Many other plants can be started by cutting. So geraniums and blood leaf and sweet potato vines are the easiest. Now, sweet potato vines are super sensitive to frost, 32 degrees, and they are toast. So we're just gonna take some cuttings here, about four or five inches long. So the same routine as before, we're gonna strip off the lower leaves, but this time we're gonna plant them in fresh potting soil. It's a good way to spend a nice afternoon. So what you need to complete this project is a rooting powder. So this stuff gets brushed on to the leaf nodes where you tore off the leaves, okay? Just lightly, lightly brush it on. And then I'm gonna make a hole, insert the cutting, and firm the soil around it. When you're all done, put it in a warm spot, water from the bottom, and in a few weeks, they will have rooted. Rob has promised me cuttings of this coleus. I love it so much. I'm just entranced with these pastel patterns. And this one is called, you guys, I found a plant tag. It's very well hidden though. It's called Christmas Candy. You know, maybe I'm a little excited for the first frost. What am I saying? No, I'm not, I'm dreading it. But if we're all prepared, we can weather the storm together.